experiences have had in finding enough staff. News 3 reporter Brendan Ponton spoke with a local expert. The general manager here of the Schooner Inn at the Virginia Beach Ocean Front says it's been a great summer, but all summer long there has been an issue in finding enough staff. As Labor Day weekend wraps up, Ocean Front businesses say there's been a shortage all summer of labor. It's definitely been a challenge. John Earn is the general manager of the Schooner Inn at the Virginia Beach Ocean Front. He says he has never been at full staff the entire summer. Everybody's had to you know, show up to work and, and work a little bit harder to, to fill in those voids. But now there's a change coming to Virginia. People who've been collecting extended federal unemployment benefits will no longer be able to get them. That's been an extra $300 a week. The program is expiring and people will only be relying on the state benefits. Earn is hopeful that will help his staffing issues. I would think it would have to help. I mean, that's been the biggest issue for us is that, you know, we've been we've been trying to compete against the federal government and, uh, you know, the private sector just can't do it. So will it really? Dr. Bob McNabb is an economist at Old Dominion University. He says other states that already ended federal unemployment benefits actually saw slower job growth than states who kept the benefits. The end of expanded unemployment benefits is not going to be the miracle cure for employers that can't find employees. McNabb says a significant number of people have simply left the workforce to retire early or because they remain worried about the pandemic or something like that. Still, with kids set to return to school this fall in person, more parents may be ready to return to work. After Labor Day, the incentives to return to work have increased. So that means parents who are taking care of kids and people who are collecting unemployment benefits now have a greater incentive to get back to work rather than to stay on the sidelines. And at the oceanfront, while summer is fading into fall, businesses are expecting to remain busy. I, mean, I think people want to travel. I mean, uh, yeah, people have been cooped up for too long. And now they hope they'll find more staff as benefits change. At the Virginia Beach Oceanfront, Brendan Ponton, News 3.